Top 10 Fascinating Facts Regarding Being a Cook Whether throughout a late-night food truck or a Michelin-starred concentration camp, being a cook is abominably tough. We think we've got a bent to all or any perceive what it's like thanks to the facade given on TV. But unless you've worked a shift throughout a section, you don't acknowledge one factor. 10 Chef's administrative body tragically died on the duty this disreputable business is brutal, and so the advancement is exclusive. It's the kind of job where you get in hassle for not conveyance a razor-sharp knife to work. Most of the folks unit unaware of the guttural underbelly to the current business associate underbelly coated in grease and pig's blood. This is a covert verify what it's love. 10. The hours unit insane. After operative over a decade among the large Apple City building circuit, I do recognize that it's customary to do and do 12 to 14 hour days, 6 to 7 days hebdomadally. Unless it's a huge company operation, smaller establishments wish constant direction from the minute the food is delivered at dawn to the vital time of day once the lights unit turned off, and additionally the place is locked up. Because of these long shifts, it's very disrespectful to travel associate building 10 minutes before closing. Lots of establishments throughout the world unit money pits. This really is also a labor of heart that affects family, friends, and personal health. 9. Knees, feet, shoes, and stink. When you're a cook, you are on your feet all day. Plain and simple. With the obscene hours, lack of sleep, strange floor surfaces, constant bending up and down, and effortful amounts of labor, it hurts. No slippery footwear is totally everything throughout an area, and in some states, it's mandated by law. If your work shoes can't get you via per week whereas not blisters and corns, move to a unique complete. And don't forget the stink. All the oil among the stuffy air throughout the dinner rush gets into your pores. The sweat seeps into your layers of cook attire, which I constantly found to be stuffy. When it's all mixed with the odor of over 12 hours on your feet, you smell a variety of a rancid space. Suppose hot yoga is intense? Mere mortals haven't powerful, true heat unless they've worked a 10-hour shift over a grill throughout an area with unhealthy ventilation during the summer. Cross-check your measuring instrument, and don't be shocked if it's at 71 degrees stargazer 160 degree F. 8. Risky work conditions. The room may well be a dangerous place. Simply ascertain the arm of a grill, salute, or broiler cook. Quite six months on the road and you will seem to be a parent needed to hide the razor blades once you were a juvenile. Crisscross scars from being in an exceedingly very hurry and touching your flesh to the sides of a liquefied broiler, oven, or pan unit traditional and welcome badges of honor. Hot vats of oil or boiling water unit constantly transported on slippery floors. Most kitchens have a bunch of deadly stairs with loose grip tape. Plus your main work tool may well be a razor-sharp chef's knife that is there to cut flesh. If you turn around into someone who's not paying attention, you will get fatally slashed. To not mention the mandolin preparation tool, that's a variety of a mini vegetable guillotine that likes to slice off. Fingertips hole 7. Every shift may well be a rope act. Throughout the machine that is associate building, every moving 0.5 should work. Most fine feeding establishments in major north yank nation cities have associate early dinner rush around 6.30 pm then a boozy 9 pm second rush. That means the building fills up throughout a matter of minutes doubly on most nights. All orders unit taken via the server and placed into the point of service computer. Then they become order tickets among the space that the cook reads aloud to the road or handles himself. So many tickets stormy and promptly causes a bottleneck, and that's why it's best to make reservations before or once these main hours. In some cases, you may even reclaim quality food as a result of food as regarding love. If the road is overworked, there will be repercussions. 6. Difficult guests. If you're a meticulous eater, own it. A lot of meticulous eaters seem to suppose it's fine to throw a hissy match at a cut house for not having further eater selections. Fussy eaters tend to be needier than the final public. From a chef's perspective, it's usually sad to check but entitled and out of touch some unit. Guests UN agency prefers to send their server to the space for every question unit speed down the full building. These unit public displays of mental instability. If you only eat organic poultry from OR, you have to be compelled to have the sense to call ahead, or please avoid the North Yank Nation altogether. Don't be thus unpleasant that you, simply that you just, simply suppose you produce the menu. You don't. 
Someone is back among the space sweating and hurt for his or her menu. 5. Relationships, Addiction, and Work-Life Balance The easiest because of adding up a fine feeding chef's schedule in an exceedingly very major city? Noon to time of day, 6 days hebdomadally. And that's being nice. When you work the precise opposite of the rest of society, its consequences. Romantic and platonic relationships will invariably be strained by the building business, albeit it's two chefs' analysis. You nearly never have each day off. Some chefs become phantoms to their kids. Between the long hours and additionally the nocturnal disorder of your social life, misuse can usually perforate. It's invariably sturdy adjusting among the beginning. But if you don't understand work-life balance, this business will grind you right down to bone dirt. Operative among the road of labor can usually wish to be in an exceedingly very cult. 4. The cook diet. Most chefs do not get enough sleep. It takes time to settle down from the mania and energy of an area. Even chefs World Health Organization go straight home do not move to bed directly. If you are lucky enough to induce out at 11.30 p.m. one night, go straight home, prepare the specials for succeeding shift, and crack open an inebriant or have a tea, it still takes time to curtail the engine that is your mind. With very little or no sleep, most chefs do not eat important breakfasts, a minimum of these I do recognize. In NY town, most chefs unit scarfing down smoothies or BECs, bacon, egg, and cheese on a bread and NYC essential on an unclean subway. With maybe 4 to 5 hours of sleep, there isn't enough time for a huge breakfast. The cook must be among the space, period. Then comes family meal, that's that the meal for the whole building staff. When every single person are on his feet for hours on end, this may be the calorie boost before the doors open. It will be superb or deplorable, counting on the building. Then there is the mid-shift snacking making a few further fries or hamburger spring rolls to pass around the space, stealing a piece of bacon, or intake a roll of bread meant for the tables. Every snack counts as fuel. For those chefs still going out once the shift and hanging with friends, nothing can affect greasy 1am sustenance, gasoline station hot dogs, or $1 dish. Most cooks and chefs eat terribly throughout their period of time if they don't have work-life balance. 3. Leading the road. Probably the foremost difficult a district of being a cook is keeping your space staffed. Restaurant work is extremely backbreaking. That's why most kitchens in major cities even the huge company ones are staffed heavily by immigrants. They are happy to be there and do not take under consideration this work a lower place than that produces them ideal candidates. This is filthy, oily, nasty, sweaty, dangerous, and underappreciated work. Americans and completely different initial world folks ought to hassle addressing the cruel work culture that produces them risky hires. Unless he options a passion for the trade, some kids of the road World Health Organization appearance niece will bite the hand that feeds him the second that he sees what he is stepping into on a daily. In larger kitchens, they have non-stop open necessitate school assignment cooks and dishwashers as a result of the work simply sucks. Most people with dreams of running their own kitchens don't want to pay three months peeling potatoes with tutelage they're going to work with a star cook. You ought to be compelled to pay your dues, which they're very difficult. 2. It's not entirely regarding the food. Working as a cook doesn't suggest that you, simply that you just, simply get to cook notwithstanding what you would like. Building a menu could be a ton of regarding provide, ordering, pars, and seasonal availability. The majority of kitchens have most ingredients ready. Once acting on a line throughout a dinner rush, you are primarily heating ready ingredients prepared by the school assignment cooks earlier that morning. Most company restaurants manufacture their menus under control kitchens in Brobdignagian work buildings. Unless you own your own place, you presumably unit merely following someone else's recipes in all probability for your entire career. The idea of ingenious freedom is irrational. This may be a structured point rather just like the alternative. If you are used your high to Sue's cook, you learn to create a menu by first creating a daily special and that's a huge maybe in some kitchens. Commercials disillusion America the foremost. Those idiotic montages of happy female of us looking out at a farmer's market at their own pace and then laughing and throwing food at each other over a stovetop as music plays among the background it's all fake. Hiring, firing, logistics, supplies, politics, and sleep deprivation unit the key requirements for running an area. 1. Is there life once being a chef? 
To survive throughout this trade, would like you wish to you need to wish to be a cook quite one thing among the globe. Often, people get sucked into it in their teens or twenties. Then they start feeling the years on the road and wish to induce out. But they can't as a result of they have kids or golden handcuffs. It's put together backbreaking to lie on a resume once you've had seven years of space experience exclusively but ought to figure in sales. Occasionally, this trade is usually attempt. You awaken ten years later and surprise what happened to your youth. It's best to never force it. I do recognize a two-star Michelin cook World Health Organization works six days hebdomadally, 5 a.m. until 11 p.m. every shift. Always smiling, never down, endlessly energetic, this specific cook defines everything that a cook has to be compelled to be. He will cook until the day he dies. That is the sort of spirit you would like to survive among the trade. Underpaid and overworked, you may exclusively persist by running on pure passion. If you like this video, please click on like it, and do not forget to subscribe to the channel to receive all new videos. Thanks for watching.